All right, hey, Josh here at a Columber Company out here in uh, Woodmore, Ohio. And check this one out here. It has a lot of gingerbread, a lot of different features on it. But you can see right here on the sidewalls, uh, the grid windows. Ah, uh, you can see it. It's a nice look there, the grids. And then also you can see uh, two frame outs or two eyebrows above the overhead doors here. So the setup here, 40 by 48, 14 feet tall. And then also you can see right here, this has a widow's peak right here on the gable end as well. And then a six foot porch, we'll walk over there. But I do want to show you, I don't know if I've shown this in previous videos if you've been following along. You can see right here, this cupola obviously is going to go up here, but this is a four foot cupola. So this is a, uh, the largest you can get standard, but if you want a special order, obviously you can always go bigger, but this is a four foot cupola right there. But I do want to show you right here. I want to show you the post selection right here. Green post. All right. A lot of people, if you're, de if you're deciding on, you know, post rot, what, what, uh, how do you, uh, how do you combat that? But this green post right here, obviously you can see that it's, uh, uh right there, uh, wrapped up on the three ply laminated column. So again, we talked about the different pressure points. Pressure point one right here, pressure point two, and then also pressure point three. That obviously for rot decay, we put green posts as well. So options to consider on your post frame. And you can see right here, how we set this up. Obviously we have house wrap on the building to give you an idea. You can see what the guys did here on the wainscoat. They put this two by six. And then obviously they're gonna put the wainscoat below that. And then two by four sidewall per, or sidewall bracing. All right. And then also, if you can see that up top right here, actually what this metal right here, this is called drip stop metal. So what this means is there's gonna be no vapor barrier on this, So the drip stop is the underneath the metal what it does it acts as a vapor barrier and it stops the uh obviously the sweating of the building so a couple interesting features there all right so the drip stop for that and then let's walk over here you can see coming off of here you can see what we did we did a dual pitch off the roof and we'll check out here obviously the mono trusses that are supporting this porch right here but uh, let's try not to fall down in this trench. But you can see right here, actually, I believe it's an eight foot porch. Maybe, yeah, it's a large six in it, maybe 10. But anyway, you see that drip stop. Let me see if I can get you a little closer to that drip stop. That's kind of where the industry's moving. People don't like that vapor barrier. But you can see that drip stop. You can see that up there. Hopefully you can see that. And then here's the mono trusses coming off so 40 by 48 kind of a storage hobby slash garage gonna look obviously pretty nice so but uh for more information obviously you can connect with us at columber.com or you can call us 419-426-barn out of columber since 1925